you know, it was hard times and everybody got together on an evening, you know, like Saturday or something, Friday or Saturday. And that's what they ended up doing was singing. It, it was because there was nothing else to do except like go to a bar and drink or something. And that's what, that's why it was, everybody would come, all of our friends, everybody, <laughs> the whole group, they'd show up at our house. We had the littlest house of anybody in the country. <laughs> and my mom could play from ear, you know, I had to, yes, a little bit, so. But it just was so fun. I mean, we were, everybody was just so happy to be there and they all sang along with no matter, <laughs> no matter who or how bad they sang or anything. You know, it was just, it was just fun. But everybody came and they all sang and it was just a riot. And even neighbors across the, the street would sometimes call the next day and thank us. just those kind of songs not nothing raunchy or <laughs> in the bars or anything so but it was it was just fun I kept thinking how can this be so much fun it's supposed to be work <laughs> but you know they're fun to play and they make you want to play by the time I was seven I was riding a bus to downtown Omaha for out in the boonies and going back and going up steps, you know. She took me, I think, once, and then after that I had to know when to get off the bus from our area and find that place, you know, those blocks, a few blocks. So, whew. and I thought, how can my mom do that to me? And then you had to walk two blocks to the, where the, the city bus was to get you back to where you lived. It was scary, but it was, it was fun too then once I got to thinking I'm, I'm not going to be lost forever. So I love doing it, yeah. I think, you know, it's just, it's like I try to put me in it because it's like, it just, it brings it out. It just makes you want to do that. At least that does me. I just, I don't know. It's just fun to play it. And it, it was, I did all that other kind of playing, you know, for when you first starting. That was boring. And because my mom could sit down and play the other way, that really helped me. She's, she still can sit down and play any damn thing. <laughs> She's like, thank God for crying out loud. How do you do that? <laughs> so it's nice. Uh, that's sent, these kinds sent forth by God's blessing, you know, in, in those kind of songs. I like, I really like those. And we sing them around town here at different things to, too. So it's just some music that you can sing. You know, you don't have to be a pers professional for anything. And, and they like the rhythm that I play, I think. That's, that's a lot of it. At least that's what they tell me. Because <laughs> I play it better than they think, <laughs> you know, than they, they are used to. And they just sing and sing and sing and sing. And even my grandmother was living with us then. And so a grandfather too. Did you like sharing a room with your grandma? Um, we had a lot of fun, actually. I made it fun. <laughs> I'd put stuff in her bed to get her, you know, and, and just different little things or something nice sometimes even. But uh, so she always, when she would go in to pull her bed down, because <laughs> I lived in the same room, she'd, she'd carefully <laughs> pull it back. But, you know, she would laugh, too. She, she was a good sport about it, so. So, there, you know, I 
guess I always thought if you can't laugh or have fun, why would you bother with anything? <laughs> Pretty much. So there. So there. <laughs> That's good.